Hey everyone, this is PK Gam. It's 12 12 a.m. Yes, a.m. I'm waiting for a snowstorm to come. Well, maybe not a snowstorm, but there is some winter weather advisories going on in our area, and I like to film the weather. I think weather is pretty awesome, and it's supposed to start anywhere between now and like 3 a.m. or something like that, so since I'll be up anyway, I'm going to film it because it's going to be the first snowstorm of the season. Well, I'm outside now and uh, not seeing anything. You can look up in the sky there. It looks kind of weird. I don't know if the camera's going to pick it up, but I'm going to get out to like here and uh, it looks like almost pinkish purple in the sky. Uh, let's try that. That might be a little bit better. Looks a bit red on the screen though, but uh, kind of, yeah. I don't know. But uh, supposedly, according to the weather maps, we should be getting snow any time now. Um, it, in fact, it looks like on the maps that it's right above us. But there's nothing. Nothing whatsoever. Oh, that's kind of sad. But you can tell definitely when snow is coming. Like, if you ever had snow in your area... Um, it just has a really calm feel to it. Like, it's really quiet. There's barely any wind. Uh, in fact, it, it would, it's kind of hard to... Yeah, there's just a little bit of wind. It's hard to tell if there's any wind at all. But yeah, you can usually tell when it's going to snow just by that alone. At least that's what I got the impression with. Yeah, but there's absolutely nothing right now. And what, what's interesting about uh, when it's snowing too is... Uh, uh, I should say when it's gonna snow or if it is snowing is that it's surprisingly bright outside. I like I'm gonna take a walk around here and I don't I no I don't think the camera's gonna pick this up but the, but you can actually see where you're going uh, in this in in what would normally be pitch black nighttime. I mean this is past midnight right here. Let me see if I can press a thingy. Uh, well, I increased the light, but that really increased the noise of the video. So this ain't gonna pick up anything other than just a lot of noise. Well, I guess you can see some trees in the background. That's our neighbor's house over there. Of course, they're sleeping. But I'm a night owl, so I'm pretty much always up. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, there's pretty much no activity whatsoever. You can look through the trees over there, and you can see the pinkish sky now. That's That's a lot better color reproduction when you look through the trees like that. I think it's because the camera can focus better this way because it's focusing on something that isn't... I, I don't know how to put it. I, this camera is kind of weird actually. Uh, let's go back to the front. Yeah, you can... Yeah, that's about the right color that you're seeing now on the screen. I might edit this video later in like to get rid of some of the video noise, but yeah, that's that's about the color that I'm seeing here. It's this weird pinkish purple. It looks pretty cool actually, but there's absolutely nothing going on right now. So I'm going to go back inside and come out when hopefully it's snowing. See you then. And it has started. I have no idea if the camera is going to focus on this correctly or not. Because I've got like, yeah, one of those things. Oh, you can see some stuff, but uh, it's currently about 1 in the morning. And this is it. This is the first real deal snowfall of the year coming. I've got my hand over the camera so it doesn't get all waterlogged. So yeah, uh, this is probably going to be like the most boring vlog in the world to you guys. Because it's like, well, I'm only talking about weather. One thing that I've learned when I was reading like on uh, art sites and stuff like that for photography and whatnot is to capture things that interest you and then you'll make something that's interesting, but I guess it varies between the between people, so to speak, yeah. Ooh, it's really starting to pick up. Oh, yeah! But we are really, really overdue for snow. It's December 4th, and it's just December 4th, I should say. It's just past midnight, uh, and uh, normally here in Wisconsin, we get snow in... Uh, early November or sometimes even October so we are really really overdue for snow so yeah that's partly why I'm excited for this it's kind of annoying to, when you have to shovel a crap ton of it but yeah 
it's it's still pretty awesome to look at and it looks cool when it coats things really pretty and stuff like that yeah oh and I just noticed this since I came out here it's, it's actually just starting to coat things around here yes indeedy here I'm gonna I don't know if, how, how I'm gonna be able to show you show this to you I swear every time something weather related happens and I want to film it it's always at night and that kind of sucks for filming. Digital cameras are not very good in night conditions, but I'm going to show you here. If you go along the road here, as I said, I don't, I don't know if you're going to be able to see this, but over by the sewer drain here, yeah, you're not going to be able to see this crap. You, it's ever so slightly coating the roads, and where the heat's coming up from the sewer over here is uh, uh, melted snow around it. Well, that's kind of disappointing. Well, at least you can see something by the light here. I'm going to come out here a little bit later when it starts showing a bit more on the ground. And hopefully I'll be able to show a bit more. Otherwise, I'm going to have to come out here in the daylight and show it off. Yeah, 2 o'clock now. We have some coverage. See that little uh, line there? Yep. I shall make a little step. And there is a footprint. Yes, it is now sticking. It is now coating. It is now falling faster. And remember I said before it was it get it seems like it's lighter when it's snowing or when it's about to snow. Take a look at it now. I don't even have to press on the this thing right here to increase the light uh, exposure thing. Yeah, just to, it's incredible <laughs> it's isn't it weird see now we can film things pretty clearly and uh, there's plenty of light to film them I, I don't know why it's like that I think it's because the Sun on the other side of the planet reflects off the the ice crystals or something like that I've heard before I, I don't know if that's true or not but yeah that's just what I heard so yep now we've got some coverage it's looking pretty dang awesome Let's just take a walk down here. I gotta cover the camera though, of course. And, uh, oh yeah, I can feel the signature squeakiness of the snow underneath my feet. And now you can see all the way down our driveway here. Yeah. See him? See him? <coughs> Excuse me. See what I mean about it being so much brighter uh, when it starts snowing? It looks cool though. I mean, this is. this. This time of the day should be pitch black, and it's not. It's gorgeous, actually. It's incredibly quiet, very very relaxing. Oh, here's the sewer that I was talking about before. Now it'll show, because there's plenty of light on it. Yep. See what I mean? Lots more light now than there was before. And I'm not even uh, doing that thing. Well, actually, this thing does make it a little better. Probably makes it a bit more noisy, though. Oh yeah, something I forgot to mention before. Like I said, that weather is awesome, but it's only awesome when it doesn't hurt anyone, you know. Otherwise, it's a disaster, you know, a natural disaster. And now it's currently about 5 a.m. or so. The grass is almost completely covered, and uh, you can see there's uh, some tracks in the snow going across there by some critter of sorts, I don't know. But, uh, yeah... I'm up this late. I actually should start going to bed earlier. I should make it a goal to start going to bed earlier. Uh, because this is actually getting to be kind of late, even for me. So, I'm going to have to start working on that. So, uh, yeah, I should probably go to bed and make a uh, video of this in the daytime. So, see you then. Behold the daylight! Ah, uh, yes, you can see! Yeah, it's definitely a lot better now than it was before. But, uh, yeah, this is basically the snow we got. Indeed, it has completely covered the grass. Awesome sauce! We will no longer see the grass until the end of the year. Well, I said that before. But, yeah, I think it looks pretty dang cool, I have to say. Let's uh, go for a walk around for the heck of it. Do, 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 do. And yeah, these this is a bridge here. You can tell the snow. Some of the snow fell in between the cracks. That's where the uh, those ridges are. There's a whole load of animal tracks around here. Or maybe that's snow just falling off of trees. I think some are animal tracks like those, and some are just snow falling off of trees like those. But uh, yes, indeedy. 
we've got about maybe it, it feels like three or four inches or so and uh, our backyard and looking the other way you see something like this this is that's where I came from there is the footprints and looking all the way down there yeah I would say like yeah that's that's about the snow depth right there probably about four inches or so awesome well that's all for the video thanks for watching everyone I would definitely appreciate it if you would give me some feedback down in the comments below you don't have to or anything if you'd want you could you could just rate rate the video or do nothing do both of them whatever I do pay attention to that kind of stuff uh, see when I started on my other channel I didn't really have any feedback to go by, so I didn't know if I was doing something good, doing something bad. You get the idea. So, again, thanks for watching. See you later.